Today we will be showing you how to replace an uplink or expansion module in a Juniper EX series switch. This video only applies to the non-line card style of EX series switches that have removable, uplink, or expansion modules. This procedure also applies to virtual chassis modules in the EX4550, but does not apply to the intraconnect or virtual chassis modules in an EX4500. For those, please see our separate video. To offline the module, use the command shown on screen to list the modules to find the location of the faulty one and then note it. Then use the next command to offline the appropriate module, then it is ready for replacement. Prior to removing the module, all cables should be labeled and unplugged from the module and then all transceivers should also be removed. There are two styles of module removal depending on your series of switch. Some will have a cover plate over the module and others will not. If yours is the style with a cover over it, you will need to undo the two captive screws securing the cover and then flip it up in order to access the module. Then insert a thin screwdriver into the keyhole shown on screen and apply upward pressure to the handle while pulling back to release the module from the chassis. Remove the screwdriver and pull the module the rest of the way out. If you do not have a cover over your module, you will simply need to undo the captive screws holding the module in place and then pull the module straight back and out of the switch. Wait at least 10 seconds before proceeding to the next step. Now you can insert the replacement module and ensure it is firmly seated. Secure it via the captive screws or by flipping the cover plate down and securing the cover plate, whichever method pertains to your series of switch. Reinsert your transceivers and reconnect all your cables. The physical replacement is now complete. If any of your module ports were set as virtual chassis ports, you must reset that port as a virtual chassis port now that the replacement is complete. If you have any issues with your uplink or expansion module replacement, please reach out to us at support at therocketplatform.com and we will assist you.